Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Mikal Tal and Rantanen. This game was played in Tallinn in 1979. Tallinn is the capital city of Estonia. Hmm, I think it's not a good idea to use the same trick three times in a row. Okay, let me introduce the players to you again. Player with black pieces is indeed Rantanen. And player with white pieces is Keres. Hmm? Keres has white pieces and he started with e4. Rantanen played c5, Sicilian defense. Knight to f3, knight to c6, bishop to b5, Rosolimo attack, e6. Keres castled kingside. Knight on g to e7, knight to c3 a6, bishop takes knight, knight takes bishop, d4, c takes on d4, knight takes on d4, d6, rook to e1, bishop to d7, knight takes knight, pawn takes knight, and now queen to g4, preventing bishop to e7. e5, Attacking the queen, queen to g3, f6, intending king to f7, bishop to e3, king to f7, rook from a to d1, white pieces are better placed, bishop to e7, knight to a4, intending c4, c5, rook to b8, b3, rook to e8, c4, and Rantanen played c5, preventing white from playing c5. But there is another problem. Now d5 square is weak. Knight to c3. The knight is coming to d5 sooner or later. Bishop to f8. f4. King to g8. Black managed to castle manually. Rook to f1. Queen to c8. f takes on e5. F takes on e5, knight to d5, white knight is well placed on d5. Black has a bishop pair, but the position is such that it doesn't give black any advantage. King to h8, rook to f7, bishop to g4, attacking the rook. How would you continue in this position if you had white pieces? I guess I would play rook to f1. But Keres played an extraordinary move. Knight to f6, sacrificing the knight. What a brilliant move. Pawn takes knight. If bishop takes rook, then queen to h4, threatening checkmate. h6. How would you continue now? There is checkmate in two. Queen takes on h6, check. Pawn takes queen, rook to h7, checkmate. So Rantanen captured the knight. Queen to h4, threatening checkmate on h7. Bishop to g7, bishop to h6. Rantanen captured the rook. Bishop takes on g7, check. King to g8 white to move. What would you do now if you had white pieces? Only one variation is good for white. Please pause the video and find the best move for white. What did you find? Keres played bishop to h8, sacrificing the rook. King takes rook. Queen takes on f6, check. King to g8, queen to g7, check, mate. What a brilliant attack. I think even Tal couldn't do better than this. What do you think? Could Tal launch even greater attack than this? And let's go back to move 24. This is the position. Did you find this brilliant move? If you did, congratulations. If 
Tal play this game? Would the game be worth more because Tal is more popular? What do you think? What do you think of this game? What do you think of this careless attack? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. Uh, just before I go, one minor correction. Player with white pieces was indeed Mikal Tal. What do you think of the game now? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.